Dynamic business scenarios today demand transparent and fast communication to resolve customer requests quickly. This is exactly what OTRS offers. Flexibility and ease of customization that promotes coordination and teamwork, allowing you to solve customer requests faster. Traditionally, customers call up or raise requests via email, which get routed to customer service agents. In case an agent is sick, the request gets routed to other agents, falls into cracks, or is just neglected due to spikes in customer request volumes. Customers, on the other hand, get increasingly impatient and contact multiple agents, leading to more confusion and chaos. OTRS solves this by offering multiple ways for customers to contact a service organization. All customer request information is stored in a data object called a ticket that is accessible to all agents. This promotes transparency and allows faster query resolution. Let's see how customer communication can be managed with OTRS. To create a customer company, click on Customers in the Customer Management section of the admin interface. Click on Add Customer and fill out the fields. To create a customer user who is an employee of the customer company, click on Customer User in the Customer Management section of the admin interface. Click on Add Customer User. Fill out the fields and your customer user is added in OTRS. A customer user can communicate his requests in various ways. Let's take a look at how he interacts with the OTRS Customer Portal. To log in as a customer into your OTRS Customer Portal, just change the URL of your OTS trial system. The customer logs in and sees the welcome screen. He clicks on Create Your First Ticket and fills out all the details. Depending on his request, the customer chooses a queue from the drop-down menu. Then, he selects the priority level of his request and clicks on Submit to create his first ticket. Besides creating a ticket, a customer can also start a chat request by clicking on Create New Chat. You can also ease the volume of requests on your team by creating an extensive knowledge base on the OTRS customer portal. The customer can access this knowledge base 24-7 and can look for an available resolution in it before contacting an agent. Now, let's take a look at how an agent can handle a new customer request. OTRS offers Service Desk agents the best overview of their tickets and an email integration feature. The unique ticket number is essential so that all follow-up communication is assigned to the same ticket as articles. Therefore, it needs to be kept in the subject line. You will see this in a minute. Agents can drag and drop dashlets to rearrange them. Clicking on the cog symbol helps them filter columns and rearrange them. Then, an agent can click on the new ticket from the customer. A red mark before the ticket number indicates urgent priority. On the right side, an agent can also view all the customer information as well as SLAs and deadlines that need to be met. Before starting work on a request, an agent needs to lock the ticket so that no other agent starts working on it simultaneously. The agent clicks on Reply and chooses an appropriate response template. Scrolling down, the agent can set up a time for a follow-up with the client in case the proposed solution does not work. Just choose the time for pending reminder and click on Submit. The agent's response is recorded as a new article in the ticket, and the response time disappears as the request has been answered within the SLA. The customer sees the agent's response on the OTRS customer portal and replies accordingly. The agent sees the new response from customer marked by a star indicating it is unread. Agents can also seek help from colleagues to resolve a request. You may click on Move to change the queue or click on Owner. A colleague can be added to the ticket as the new owner with a note requesting help. When you log in as another agent, you can see now a new ticket assigned to you as the new owner. Click on it and view all the previous communication exchanged with the customer. This way, the client receives a response even when his point of contact is unavailable. You can even view a detailed, audit-proof record of all activities done within the ticket by clicking on History. If you think you have successfully solved the customer request, click on Close Choose if the ticket resolution was successful or unsuccessful and write a short note about it. And you are done. There is a lot more you can do with OTRS and its additional feature add-ons. To know more, get in touch with our sales team today.